Here at Davis Auto Sports, we are very, very excited to offer you this absolutely gorgeous, one of a kind uh, FJ Cruiser. This is perhaps the nicest, baddest FJ Cruiser uh, on the entire market, perhaps uh, one of the top 10 ever built. Uh, this thing is absolutely insane, ridiculous, a legitimate $30,000 invested in this vehicle. Half of what you see on this vehicle was just done here at Davis Auto Sports. Uh, custom paint, custom Fabtech lift, new wheels, tires, uh, supercharger, the list goes on and on and on. Uh, I'll do a, a general walk around of the vehicle. It's a 2007, uh, 53 or 54,000 miles. The exact mileage will be shown in the cluster here in a minute uh, and on our website and on eBay. Uh, this thing is absolutely gorgeous. Phenomenal, phenomenal condition. Uh, I've been driving this truck for the last couple days and uh, been getting absolutely a ton of people talking to me about the vehicle. It's uh, just truly one of a kind. Um, here at Davis Auto Sports, we do specialize in building uh, a lot of vehicles. Please go to our website, davisautosports.com. Uh, we're, we're a sport car, exotic car, off-road dealer, uh, as well as a performance shop. And uh, we just love taking in vehicles and turning them into uh, what you see with this vehicle and many of our other vehicles. Um, this thing is truly, truly one of a kind. Uh, if you look at other lifted FJs on the market right now, there's nothing that even comes close to this. A uh, ton and ton of time and money put into this vehicle. Um, I don't even know where to start on this thing. Uh, I I'm not going to go over everything. It'll just take way too long. Just make sure to read the entire listing. I'll go over some of the uh, more important items on this vehicle. Starting off, uh, this vehicle has our full Line-X package. Uh, the Line-X scene on this vehicle probably took us three to four days with multiple guys working on it. So uh, front bumper, completely Line-X. Front grill guard and hood guard, completely Line-X. Front header panel, Line-X. Uh, front portion of the hood, completely Line-X. Bushwhacker fender flares, Line-X. Rocker panel, from the gap down line x brand new side step tubular rocker protectors all line x fender flares done rear bumper bottom rear quarters entire back bumper um obviously same thing on the other side i'm going to go ahead and lift this up entire roof as well as the roof rack is all line x so any metal components on this vehicle that have been line x have been sanded down primed prepped sprayed everything was taken off of the vehicle to get done any plastic that was line x sanded down plastic adhesive applied then line x this stuff is on there and this is legitimate line x it's not some stuff out of a, a, a spray paint can uh up front all brand new lighting on the vehicle uh what we actually did to the pia lights we completely custom painted those so this vehicle uh was custom painted a lamborghini gray uh we have the paint for the seller uh for touch-ups and everything else uh and just to touch on the paint on the vehicle all your jams were done throughout the whole vehicle even inside there all up top the vehicle was taken apart to be painted it was done correctly all parts of the doors were done so this is not just your tape up and spray paint job on this vehicle absolutely beautiful color on the truck and goes perfect with the black line x so back to the up front all of our pia lights we have six of them on the vehicle 
Uh, and these are blue lights when they shine too. They're not the typical 4000K, they're 6000K bulbs. So if you take a look at the grills, uh, they are painted the same color as the vehicle. That was very tedious. Every single one of these nooks and crannies had to be sanded down, had to get cleaned up, surface prep, then sprayed, and then the white part was sprayed, uh, then clear coated so that the shine matches obviously the shine of the paint. So very tedious work there. Uh, our front lights and rear lights, if you notice, have a very, very slight tint to them. Uh, they're not blacked out, but they have a very nice tint. Uh, we actually do that here. We, we, we scuff them with 3000 grit sandpaper. We actually mix clear coat with a little bit of black base coat uh, to spray those. Um, also have all brand new lights, the bumper. Is beautiful brand new quick disconnect d-rings brand new winch has never been used we just installed that as well uh, you have your angel eye uh, headlights another thing that we color match just because the paint is so beautiful are the fabtech pro uh, pro logic shocks as you see the bodies of them are the same color as the body of the vehicle and since they're visible uh, it looks absolutely awesome so that's a really nice touch that we did to the vehicle This thing just looks absolutely mean going down the road. We obviously all brand new rubber all the way around. Uh, may have 10 miles on them from uh, me driving, probably not even that much. All the electronics on this vehicle. Uh, we have a 12 volt specialist that works here in house for us. All the wiring has been soldered. Uh, there's no butts being connected for wire. So everything that's ran on this vehicle, uh, we got a couple days just in uh, soldering all the wires being ran. We also have a brand new battery uh, in the vehicle as well. Uh, condition wise, this vehicle is absolutely as clean as you can get. Beautiful condition. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous truck. Everything on this truck is absolutely top of the line. Very expensive Fabtech lift. These tires alone, you can go look them up. They're 35, 12 and a half by 20 Nitto Trail Grapplers. It's, I mean, you're just back of $2,000 just in tires. So um, everything on this, there's no corners being cut. Uh, your bumper is your Fab Fours bumper. Uh, this unit right here, uh, you can look it up online, that retails for right around $3,500 just for the upper piece. The bumper below is almost another two grand within itself. So that front end minus the winch and the lights is, is five grand just in bumpers and, and guards. You, you factor in everything in, the lights, the, the winch, everything else. I mean, you're, you're at uh, almost, if not more than $6,000 for the front and that's not including labor. So. 20 inch wheels, not a 17 or 18, a very modern 20 inch wheel to give it a nice, beautiful look. I'm gonna go ahead and show you all the door jams on this side of the vehicle. Even up here was done. Inside of this vehicle is absolutely spotless. Uh, the seats are perfect. The floor is perfect. The headliner is perfect. Uh, you got your leather uh, borders, your leather backs, leather headrest. Um, it's just absolutely as clean as you can possibly get. Center console area is super clean. We got our brand new winch controller right here. does have boiler exhaust. We just rerouted uh, the rear tips as well. All done here in house. If you're looking for a full fifth wheel spare, we'll be more than happy to mount one uh, up top. Obviously, uh, extra cost on that, but I think that would really set this vehicle off. Uh, but we had to really control ourselves on this vehicle uh, to somewhat keep the, the budget down. Once again, interior is absolutely spotless. 
no odors of any kind. 53,534 miles. This vehicle does have a TRD twin screw supercharger. Uh, full intake, full exhaust system. I'm gonna go ahead and stop here and throw my seatbelt on real quick. Everything inside of this vehicle is absolutely spotless. Pretty much looks, feels, smells. Look at the pillars. It's all like a brand new vehicle. We are located here at Richmond Airport. There's UPS loading up for the evening. So if you're interested in flying in, uh, you can fly into Richmond International Airport and we'll be more than happy to pick you up. Uh, this vehicle drives absolutely awesome uh, for a lifted vehicle uh, with the tires. I mean, it, it actually is really smooth. We build a ton of Jeeps here, so we're just really used to Jeep suspension, and this thing's really uh, a dream to drive compared to some of the, the Jeeps that we build, which are a little bit rougher. If you're hearing anything, that's stuff in the center console uh, moving around. Hear the supercharger. It's exactly how a twin screw supercharger is supposed to sound. It has a whine to it. Uh, the vehicle right now is only running six pounds of boost on the supercharger. It's pretty conservative. It's what the pulleys come with stock. Uh, you can increase it to eight, but you really don't need it. The vehicle. Uh, I'm also going to do a full turn. There's no rubbing of the wheels on anything whatsoever. You have plenty of lift. You can actually fit a bigger tire, but we prefer the 35. Looks better, and you have a lot of flex room. That is just the key to the wheels, and they're moving around. As you see, this truck really goes with the supercharger. Sounds awesome as well. You got the the wine of the supercharger, you have the boiler exhaust, it's a, it's a nice little combination. Everything has been tested on the vehicle, windows, radio, four wheel drive, AC, defrost, uh, everything works exactly as it should. Steering wheel is absolutely spotless does not get any better than this if you guys have any questions about this vehicle please feel free to contact me directly my mobile phone is 202-491-9929 you can also reach us online at davis d-a-v-i-s autosports.com thank you